uh, hello again. So now we shall create our uh, shortcut. Now creating a shortcut is a very straightforward process. We're still inside of the Pi user account. So you'll open up the file explorer and you go to the documents folder. That's where you stored uh, PLIP. You open up PLIP, you open up tools and there are two Python scripts in here. One is an auto run creator, the other one is a shortcut generator. Now we're going to make the shortcut so you have to double click shortcut.generator. Now you can ignore this for the time being, it's going to be used elsewhere, but it's a handy tool uh, that you'll use later. Go to the parent folder and now you can see a PLIP shortcut. Now this shortcut it doesn't make sense for you to use it on the Pi account so what you'll want to do is you'll go to the start button go to shut down and you select the option log out. We'll now go, go to our uh, yeah so we will now go to the other account and uh, my sc the screen might do a little bit crazy uh, that's because of the VNC, it has to switch from account uh, I'm now logged in in the public user account so this is VNC and you won't see it it's something I had to enable to make sure that I could record uh, the screen Now we, are in, now we are in the guest users account. We go to file manager and we uh, select or we go to the parent folder of home-public. That's because we want to view the content that's being stored in the Pi's user account. So you click the upwards facing arrow, open the folder called Pi, open the folder called documents, you open then the folder called PLEAP and here's the shortcut we've just created. We will copy that shortcut and store it on our desktop. And that's it. There's nothing more to this.